spicy, to be honest. Cause last okay, time, so... <laughs> no, me, I'm sorry, I just started recording again. So what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna... I'm gonna mute you for a bit, okay? Don't get triggered. This is this way. Okay, I know. Okay, so what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna aim right here at the bridge, you're gonna wanna throw your transponder. Now, I saw, sorry I already did that, so I'm gonna go ahead and do this. You're gonna end up right in here. Now you're gonna wanna go right here, walk across, see this safe, over here, to this bench right here. You wanna jump on that, turn around, go over here. If I'm going too fast, go ahead and pause the video, because I know when I was first learning this, I went way too fast. Okay, now you're gonna wanna stop right here, just for safe measures, and you're gonna wanna sprint jump onto this rock because there is a hole down there that you cannot get out of and you have to just kill yourself. Okay, now for this, you're gonna come over here, you're gonna jump into that, and then you can just walk carefully, make sure to stay over to the edge. Zombies will be spawning over here, so you're gonna wanna be careful too. You're gonna come over here, hop up here, all the way over here. Now this one isn't specific, so it doesn't really matter. That one you have to be extremely careful with. And, um, Okay, now you're gonna come over here, you're gonna hop up on top of this, drop down here, stick to the wall, walk all the way into this cor corner, then you're gonna turn this way, walk all the way this way, until you get stopped, and then you're gonna do this, back a little bit, and then you're gonna wanna jump up here, all the way over here, and then you're gonna walk right there, into that rock. And then you'll walk right in here. You'll be right here. This is another little place where if you really want, you can just stay here. Zombies will spawn right there, and then they will run out. Honestly, I feel like it's a waste because of how good this spot will be. So from right here, you're gonna be, you're just gonna want to walk left until you're on the edge of this here. Now you're going. To, do not test it. I do not know if you will fall off of this. I'm just staying on it. So. You're going to walk all the way forward until you drop. Once you drop, you're going to walk backwards, walk backwards, keep going, keep going, keep going until you see this. Then you're going to turn this little bit, okay? It's not a lot, it's not a little. And then you're going to go forward. You'll end up in here, in this little area. Okay, so now once you're here, congratulations, you finished the first half. Let's go to the second half. Now, you're going to want to enter through this wall right here. It'll pop you through. You'll be down here. Now, if you don't want to go straight to the glitch, you can go ahead and run around in here. You can build up these boards if you want. You can do all of that. Zombies will spawn, and you can kill them over here, and they won't do shit. Or you can go through here. And this is where the glitch finally begins. Now, uh, hopefully, if you're doing what I'm doing with the M1, then you can have it packed punch so that you can just easily sh shoot them in the head, and all the zombies will be dead. Now there is a barrier here, so you don't really have to worry about it just yet, but when you come over here, if you do have zombies on you, you're going to want to kill them because it's quite hard with the zombies trying to hit you off. Now right here, this blue bench, you can walk and jump into that, but what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to look right here, and you're going to just pop down onto this. It's an invisible barrier, and you want to keep walking along this. Just walking along that. Then once you get about here right here this will work you're gonna want to jump onto here bam final second the final destination now for the one I'll be doing you're gonna pop down here you want to stand right in that container right there that is the best spot I have found zombies can't hit you on a clown round you're going to want to just lay down and none of the, the zombies may hit you a few times or so but they're just going to explode and you just, just kind of get to watch and get a free max ammo because you can just kind of pop out for a second to be able to go get it. Um, then you're going to come, if you're doing the hailstorm one, like if you have the ordinance and you can get mad points from that, you're going to come over here, do the exact same thing. I haven't, I'm not a big fan of the hailstorm. I don't, I like the M1 much more, especially since it's a bit better than the hailstorm in my opinion. The Tropic Thunder is not as good as the T-Money. So you'll just pop down and you'll go down there and get it. And I will show a tiny bit of gameplay for this. You're going to want to just run over here. Pop down, like I said. Sit in this. And you have arrived at your final destination. Now, there was Mork. He died. He's stupid. Don't even worry about it. Honestly, I don't even think... I'm pretty sure he probably killed himself because he got enough money to do whatever he wanted. Okay, but you see you're not getting hit there will be a zombie or two or three right there depending on where you're standing and then they'll just <coughs> excuse me 
they'll just all pile up right here and you can just go boom 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 rounds over instant money and that is how you will be doing the best glitch that i have found you can also do it over there with a hailstorm like i said if you did enjoy it go ahead and try this out for yourself tell me the highest round that you've been able to get to and i will see you guys in the next video